continues to grow increasingly worse in our state. Health officials say it could be days, even weeks, before we actually hit the peak. One question we keep seeing over and over again is, can you get the flu not once, but twice in one season? For that answer, we bring in NBC's Dr. John Torres. Good to have you here. Thank you. You bet, Melissa. How are you doing today? Very good. So let's tackle that question I just posed. Can you get the flu twice in one season? You know, as strange as it sounds, and I don't want to be the bearer of bad news, but it turns out, yes, you can get the flu twice in one season. Here's the reason why. Most people right now are getting type A flu, the H3N2. Well, it turns out there's actually four viruses circulating, two type A's and two type B's. If you get type A right now, once you recover, you're vulnerable to get that type B that's going to come later. Hmm. It's just now starting to come into the picture. And tonight on Nightly News, we're going to talk about a child who actually had it twice. So you get one flu shot. There's some people that will get a booster. Does that help? Does it, 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 is there any benefit? You know, the booster itself is probably needed for somebody who's immunocompromised or doesn't have a strong immune system, especially the elderly. But more importantly, people that have not gotten a flu shot, once they get the flu, they think they can't get it again. The problem is you can get it again because, again, you get that second strain coming in and the first strain doesn't protect you at all. So if you did not get the flu shot and you get the flu, Wait until you're recovered, and then go get the flu shot itself. Such, and so, again, that can help you. Such an important topic. We're out of time. Just very quickly, what are you doing to protect yourself and your loved ones right now? Most importantly, get the shot and do a lot of, you know, the hygiene, the hand washing, the sneezing into your hands, staying home if you're sick. That's probably the biggest thing. Dr. John, thank you so much. I know you'll continue this you conversation on NBC Nightly News coming up at 630. Thank you.